keeping the truth correct. Hey, bartender, a round of shots are definitely in order for Lady Antebellum. With both Charles and Dave hailing from the Peach State, the trio will be heading back home following news that they will soon be inducted into the Georgia Music Hall of Fame. Yeah, we The three will be owning the night during their official induction ceremony set to be held October 11th when they'll join the likes of Chet Adkins, Brenda Lee, Ray Charles, and Otis Redding in the state's prestigious hall. Play it again, play it again, play it again. Luke Bryan fans, prepare yourself. The singer has just released a deluxe edition of his double platinum album, Crash My Party. The updated collection features four new songs, including the fan favorite, Your Mama Should Have Named You Whiskey. Luke is currently on the road in support of his That's My Kind of Night tour. Be sure to watch Headline Country on September 4th when we're going to hit the road with Luke for his stadium show at Chicago's Soldier Field. Not even one month after Casey Musgraves wraps up her stint on Katy Perry's Prismatic World Tour, the two-time Grammy winner will be setting out on her own headlining run titled Same Tour, Different Trailer, a comedic take on her critically acclaimed Same Trailer, Different Park album. The 13-city tour will begin September 25th in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and will feature budding new duo John and Jacob. Billy Currington's latest hit, We Are Tonight, has just earned him his career ninth, number one, and second in a row from his current album by the same name. The song was co-written by hot newcomer Sam Hunt, who's been on a bit of a winning streak of his own lately. We don't have to go home, we can leave the night on, but we can leave the night on. Along with gaining popularity as an artist with his latest single, Leave the Night On, Hunt is quickly becoming one of Nashville's top songwriters as well, having helped pin such hits as Keith Urban's Cop Car and Kenny Chesney's Come Over. Hunt's four-song EP, X2C, is available now with a full-length project in the works to hit stores October 27th.